In today's video, we're gonna be unboxing a live fish mystery box that we ordered off the dark web. Last time we got a box that had two locked safes inside that we had to crack open in order to get to the fish. We ordered this box weeks ago, and now that it has finally arrived, let's see what kind of surprises are actually inside. Yo, Whoa. what the heck, What bro? is in here, bro? What? Leaking jar. <laughs> hmm. We're locked up. Yo, there is smoke coming out of this package right now. Oh my God. Dude, there could be a fish Flip in there. Dude, there there's could be a right fish there. in there. Something red. Smash it. Holy crap, there's all the fish, bro. All right, time to start my daily routine. What the heck? Empty, empty. You gotta be kidding me. Where's Chris? Chris, did you touch my Keeps hair restoration kit? Does it look like I've touched your hair restoration kit? Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sure? I used it. Big shout out to Keeps for sponsoring today's video. This is me right here before I started my uh, hair loss restoration journey about, I would say a year and a half ago. That, uh, that scared me. That was a big wake up call. I was totally losing my hair. Every time I would go to the gym, Brooke would take a picture of my, the top of my head and it'd be like, SpongeBob, bald. Now it is hard to come to terms with the fact that you're losing your hair and you have to take action. But then I started researching male pattern baldness, all this stuff, it just happens. All dudes thin out on the top of their head. And I am super happy because I took action immediately as soon as I saw signs, and that's what you guys should too. If you see any, if, even if it's the smallest sign of your hair thinning, you wanna take action, I'm so glad because my hair has come back with a vengeance. Now, if you are looking to start your hair restoration journey, I cannot recommend Keeps enough. It is super convenient, it's so easy, it comes right to your door. You can opt for shipment plans every three, six, 12 months, whatever's easy for you guys, and it's super affordable. Keeps offers treatments that are clinically proven to work, and most people will see results within six months. I saw results pretty quickly because I was, I was really diligent about it, so you gotta be diligent and you gotta start early. Keeps has over 4,500 five-star reviews with impressive before and after photos from real customers. So hair loss stops with Keeps. For a special offer to get started, Go to keeps.com forward slash the fish guys or click the link in the description. That's keeps k e e p s dot com forward slash the fish guys. So get yourself looking right. This is me before. Ah, oh, scary. This is me now. My hair is coming back. I got it, Jack. Don't worry. Looks like you got that one under control, Chris. You're on the left. Thank you. Wow, guys. What a strange shape of a box. Eh? Very interesting box. This is one we have never gotten before. Definitely not. We always, always usually get the big square. It's about a 24 by 24 cube. perfect square. Cube, cube, cube. Cube, because it's three dimensional. Yes, that is correct. But this box is a skinny flat box, which could be good or bad. Which could be very good or bad. This could be a box of snakes. This could be a box of, you know. Cockroach. Cockroaches. Cockroach. You don't know because it's flat not used to it. What we do know is that this exact box came from the same place that sent us the two safes, all right? That was an insane video, so let's throw it back to that right now. Two freaking safes, Chris. Is that a safe? It's open. This is a full-blown skeleton of a fish. <laughs> what Look the it. heck is that? There's the fish. Hella fish. Yeah, there's a reason. That was freaking insane. That was a All right, that was probably one of the best dark web packages we've ever received. You guys wanted us to order another one, so we went ahead, ordered another one from the exact site, and it came in like this. I think we might have found one of the best dark web websites ever. Let's go, Chris. You get that side, I'll get this side. You gotta always be on high alert. You gotta always be on guard. Oh, just the first layer of skin was sliced. <laughs> Good thing. I got the center. You know, everything comes in threes, and this week I have had Two injuries already with knives and sharp objects. First injury, doing the dishes, sliced my finger almost completely off. Thankfully, it's healed, rather. Ooh, wow, Chris. That will be a scar. Then, yesterday, Brooke's like, oh, I got this fancy gadget at the, at the kitchen store. It attacked me like a wild <laughs> animal. Garlic cutter literally leaped and attacked me, almost cut my finger off again. <laughs> Same finger. Whoa, whoa, I'm flicking me off. Yeah, same finger. Ooh, that's a, that's yeah, a no, gnarly it, it one. Was, it was gushing. And then I almost just cut myself with this, so. What do you say? I think we open, open this up, come on. Uh, this, is, uh, this is one of the more exciting ones I've been, I've been ready for. Ooh, Ooh into wow. this. This is freaking dope, oh, they like They like making us work for it. Dope. Dude, wow. We have what seems to be three very large objects. Yes. Very large objects. These are just always- Cheetos. They look so appetizing. Please do not put that in your mouth. I'm not, I'm not. Who knows where this came from? Although they but are look like Cheetos or scene, Pirate's Booty. That scene from Elf when he's just eating the cotton balls, like I feel like I do that with these. Big development. I wear Crocs now. The ultra sport mode Crocs. With with socks on and I'm in, I'm in sport mode. Those are actually fire. I'm not in lounge mode. 
These my dad got me for Christmas. Those I see him wearing those sometimes. Yeah, he, he my dad fire? wears these. Those are fire. Those Don't are fire. Freaking sleep on the Crocs. They absolutely slap. Dude, holy crap! All right, I really want. To, I feel like this is a bag of fish. All right, let's get see that then. Let's see what we got here. Okay, this is gonna be a freaking. Don't get mess. anything in the yard, bro. This is gonna be a mess, bro. Leaking jar. Weaking. Leaking jar. Weaking, Weaking badly. How do you open this? I have so much liquid on my fingers. I think I just fingers. got a glimpse. Oh my god. Those are remains. Those are. Those are remains. <clears throat> That's a rooster god foot, Chris. I'm touching the liquid, bro. Oh my god! Four, uh, uh, 2318, 2318. 2319, Wicked bro. pissa. Wicked! <laughs> hmm. Hmm. What the Just hell even is that? Because I'm not even touching that Turkeys, anymore. turkey feet, Dude, chicken feet. this is feet. all wet, bro. We're gonna have to hose this area down. This is actually disgusting. This whole bag is wet. I can't open it, Brooke. Oh my god. Does it smell? What on God's green earth? Does it smell? It's chicken foot soup, bro. Is it chicken? Or is that turkey? This look like big feet, bro. Oh God, look at the tendon. Holy sh! Look at the, That's look funny. at the nails on that thing. That is strange. They have some serious nails. Yeah, no, they, that could, that could. Those are big feet. Dude. Those are huge. Those That's are something... why I'm thinking maybe it's a turkey. Those are some massive, could be a freaking wild animals. Is there anything else inside there? I don't think there's anything living in here, which is good. That's amazing, actually. My hands are so wet with so much salmonella now. I know, so is mine. It's honestly disgusting. Do not touch anything. We should put this over here. Put it on the ground. I don't know how we're disposing of this. This should be caution tape. This should be caution the tape. The box is soaking wet, dude. Let's get everything out. Grab it. Oh, that's a case. This is gonna be. This is gonna be good in here. That's a freaking case. Ew! It's it's soaked. It's it's, soaked. Oh sh! Soaked. Man. It's soaked. It's soaked. Okay. All right. What's this? I'm this is back. wet too. It's disgusting. That's all going straight into the freaking garbage. The whole box with the chicken or with the noodles. Yeah. Throw everything out. Yo. Oh, we're, locked up. we're locked up. Yo. Get the bolt cutters. What the what? That's a lockage. Checking. Checking, always check for a key. If you guys remember from last Darkwood video, the safes actually, we found a key inside one of the safes. It was a key yes, inside there, of a safe. We and opened then, one and there was a key inside of the safe that opened get into the, the other next one. key. So maybe we next have a safe. It could be, it's got a lot of compartments. I'm a little bit grossed out. Now, if this is locked, then that means this must be the clue. Because if you're thinking if you're like, thinking like that, clues, yes. Okay. Open, open. There's steaming, there's steaming coming out of it. Could be anthrax. Zip that up. Zip that up. Think you don't go outside. near that. Gas masks. Gas masks. Should we mask up? I mean, this is not. You might have to slice that thing. Wow, that's an incision. I don't know what this is doing versus know opening doing the either. zipper. Just open the zip. Okay. Be careful. Get get down wet. Don't get it. Get yes! There is smoke coming out of this package right now. Oh my God. Ah! Dry ice confirmed. Is there a fish in that? Dry ice confirmed. Hold on, there could be a fish frozen in this block right here. Dry ice Can confirmed. I touch this or am I burn myself? I don't know. I don't know. We need a hammer. We need We're going to smash this? We have to. You think there's, there's a fish? Well, dude, there could be a fish in it, that. Flip it. Flip it. Is it. We're going to get burned. I don't know. Careful, Chris. Dude, there there's could be a right fish there. in there. Something red. Something red. Something red. Something red. You know, some fish actually freeze. Could be a red dragonette. Some fish actually freeze and stay alive in the winter. I could think. be a red dragonette. How are we going to get this out? We smash need a hammer. it. Go get the freaking hammer. Brooke and you, I have touched salmonella. Brooke got us our hammer. Here you go. Sweep it in. Chris, do not let that touch me. I'm not Dude, kidding. it's fine. Whoa! Oh! That's so weird. No matter how old you get, you still love seeing bubbles, man. <laughs> so I'm, I'm always down for a bubble. Who doesn't bath? love a good smoke machine and bubbles? Dude, I'm we're going to leave this thing just ripping it. Damn, did you hear that? Whoa! Let's that's go! Sick. Dude, that's actually dope. I'm, I'm already, it's already a 10 for me. This is like a- I'm sorry. It does not matter how old you are. This is, this is exciting. Lit. I, we can all throw it back to some point in our career of school. You get this, you get the rubber band with the soap, you pull it over, you let that big bubble form, and then it pops. Oh, we should have got that. Tornado dish. Yeah. I could play with this all day. I know, all right, let's get to the side. I don't want to get to the side, I love this. <laughs> Oh my god. Put it down. Let it be a back smoke drop. All right, yeah, yeah. Let it be a. Let It'll it... be the smoker like for Halloween. All right, we're going to have a smoke machine behind us. This is what we're trying to get to because I'm 99% sure there's a frozen fish in here. Smash I don't know, it. I don't know if you guys can see that pink right there. Red dragonette. That's Dude, a red that dragonette. That might bro. be a fish. Smash it. Smash you it, Chris. Wearing, right? Like you mean it. Good job. Good job. Oh, we're in. We're in. We're in. It's right here. It's right here. Glass. It's right here. Hi! Keep going, Chris. 
Smash it. I got hit with this piece of glass. I feel like oh, I'm yeah, yeah, we're here. chiseling, we're chiseling. It's like we're diamond hunting. Chisel it, chisel it, chisel it. Yeah, that's a fish. It's freaking concussed. We're in. Part-time job. Nice. What, what is that? Here? Really stuck. Are you sure it looks kind of like an really angler stuck. fish? Really freaking stuck. Give him another decision. Give him. Got it. I like that. Okay, it's not a fish. It's not a fish, confirmed. How are we gonna get inside Looks that? Looks like a balloon. How are we gonna get inside that? Balloon. We need to be, make sure we get inside There's that. There's a tab here. Get, get going. It's a frozen duct tape, dude. <gasps> we might need here we go, here we go, here we go. Yes, there you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. Nice, Chris. Nice, nice. Keep it up, man. Thank Doing you. a good job. Thank you. Don't forget about our smoke back here. <laughs> Let me add some suspense. <laughs> yeah, please, please. This is, this is ungettable. Oh my God. Let me use your knife. Keep working. I'm gonna cut myself. Just please thing. don't cut yourself, Chris. We got a tea time. Got it. Nice, Chris. Easy, don't, don't. Got it. Don't lose what you got going. Ah, well, Jack's working on that. I don't think we're getting in this. Practice the swing a little bit. With a hammer? That's a good swing. That's a good swing. Dude, there is, it's, it's a, what you is can't that? get through this, bro. Guys, I'm actually getting somewhere. I'm actually getting somewhere. Seriously, might've got, might've have it, might have it here. You're, might have it here. Oh, it's the key. It's the key. It's the freaking key. Let's go. That's it's huge. It's the freaking key, bro. That's huge for the Colch. But it's a, it's a frozen icicle oh. key. Don't, dude. Dude, honestly, I love this, bro. Open I love it. these. Open it. I, I, you know, I'm a, I love uh, scavenger hunts. We're in. We're in. Popped it's it. open? Popped it. Popped it. Okay. Let's the moment off. of truth we have unlocked. Let's go, baby. Holy crap. There's all the fish, bro. There's there all are. the freaking fish, bro. Many bags. Let's rapid fire. Many these. bags, many bags. Hey, Small hey. bag first. Big we got crabs. big old crabs. Big here, old dude. crabs. Get the jaw. These are mega megalodon well, actually, crabs. Actually, I don't know bro. if we need the jaw for the crab. These are, oh my oh, god, look at dude, that. That guy's huge. Look at that hot. Look at him freaking rolling. He's trying to get away, dude. I think that guy would really mess you up. Yeah, that's a big boy. Look at the size of that claw. That is a big That boy. is a big claw, bro. Let's Let put check him in. this one out. Oh, he's gonna get me. I don't know if this guy's even alive. Oh no, he's alive. Three crabs. All right. That's a start. All right. Let's, let's get our crabs in our bucket because we're gonna save these guys for the uh, aquarium. If we had a puffer fish, he would go ham on these guys. Oh my God. All right, let's get into the next thing. big old crab. The classic crab. Now listen, we're about to see what kind of fish. We have a big bag here. We got like three good sized bags. We really small, do, medium, bro. Big, you know what I'm let's, saying? Let's go like this then. One, yeah. two, three. Let's, let's, do, let's that. do that. No, let's do that. Let's jump into it. Now, if you guys haven't already gotten yourself, we just restocked because they were completely sold out. We just restocked the Respect the Locals hoodies that you guys absolutely love. It is hoodie season. That's why I'm rocking this one. This is our other new one. And we restocked our Bass Guy performance tee. You guys love those this holiday season. So get them while they are restocked. Now let's get into this bag. Nice. This is a sick clown. I think he is. Can I good. have him? Take him. Bro. I want him for my tank. Hang on. I'm making a decision. Wow. Let's talk about it. I got a pro oh, bro, he's dope. He's jet black. Sick. I want this thing, bro. He's jet black, a little bit of orange. Does he have white on both what sides of the cheek? What kind of clownfish is this? Let me know down in the comments. I'm Only not sure. one gill has a white dot. He has, he's all black, white face, and one... <laughs> I'm sorry, all I see is Jack's face through it. He's all black, orange face, and has one white speckle. That is so badass, dude. Put it down. Let's pick him up. I think, I don't know what this is. It's, it's got one white dot right there. And then on the other side, it's got no white dot. So that's very, very strange right there. Really cool little clownfish, bro. I like that thing, bro. Yeah, that's sick. So that's the very first fish of this. I want him. You can have him. I think, I don't know what that is. I love him. It's Put him in the bucket. And we're, gonna, we're gonna see where everyone's gonna go at the end. So many choices. There you go, guys. Epic. Enjoy. Hate the yellow water they use though. I really wish it was clear, but that's okay. Next. Could be urine. Sorry. <laughs> it could be urine. A little sprinkle in each, in yeah, each little... bag just to really screw us over. Salmonella and urine, sweet. Let's get the next bag going here because I am Whoa, honestly bro, that's ready. A, that's a sweet lip? Is it? Freaking oh, gorgeous. There it is right there. Oh, that, that is freaking is beautiful. That's a if I, that's a sweet lips that's for a sure. That's not the brown, lips. that's not the bright and bright. That's not the brown and white sweet lips. That is the striped sweet lips. That is a freaking gorgeous fish nonetheless, man. Let's get this guy in the bucket just so we can see him a little bit better. Wow, bro. Look at that. What a freaking bucket of fish right there. Isn't that crazy? Look at that fish. This fish right here is freaking beautiful. He's actually perfect size to go with my fish in my 55 gallon at my room. So it's pretty dope. The sweet lips actually have the sickest colors. This guy, he's like got a little we bit. We always get the spotted ones for some reason, but this guy is sick. He's, Yellow, brown, you see the little blue white. Up here? 
Yeah, he's got a little blue. I, honestly, my favorite is the yellow. Yellow is just a great color. It brightens up every freaking aquarium. When you turn that light on, you see some nice yellow tang. That's fantastic. It's nice. Yellow tang is very hard to come by now, believe it or not. Actually, you know what? Me and Jack, when we first had a saltwater tank, we bought like 10 yellow tangs one day. And they <laughs> so were like cool. 29 bucks each. And now they're $450 for one yellow tang here. Wow, we were so dumb. That's like buying a stock at the all time low. Yep. We had but, 10 of them, we had $4,500 worth of fish. Yep, it's like buying Apple for when 10 was, bucks a share. Now it's sitting at 190. Wow. A yellow tang, one is $450. They're so rare. And they sell like that. Let's go with the grand finale bag here. Jack, you can do the Thank honors you, for this one. All right. Anything else in this bag though? You really make sure you check all the pox. There could be a secret, comp what is that? Interesting there. There's something else in here. I don't want to touch this bag. That is a sick fish right there. Dude, I think that's a, I that's think a, that's a parrot, that's bro. A parrot. Holy crap, that's the world's smallest parrot fish. That's a parrot right there. We catch, we catch these guys, man. We that catch is these wild. guys. I'm not sure these guys are, like this guy's pink. We usually catch know. the blue parrots. Yeah, we usually catch all blue. I don't know what about this guy, but he is an interesting fish. I like him a lot. Should we get him in the bucket? Yes. Take a look. What a, whoa, bro. Dude, that's a fire That's bucket. a good group of fish, man. That's a nice group of fish. Well, you guys, that was another freaking awesome dark web unboxing. The DW, the dark web. If you guys want us to order another one from the same exact website, let us know down below in the comment section or if this video gets, heck, I'm gonna go with 12,000 likes. If this video can get 12,000 likes, I will order another one right there. Get that thing arrived. Who knows? This thing I might come in a one. cylinder of, I don't know. I don't know what it might come in and neither will you guys until it is here. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to go check out fishguy.shop. Hope you all have a blessed year. Fish guys, out. Peace.